Welcome back. In this video we're going to do takeaway 5, which is about the relationship between homogeneous systems and linear dependence. So the dependence equation a1v1 plus a2v2 all the way through akvk equals 0 for vectors is equivalent to a homogeneous linear system, which we'll call h. This a system h has n equations and the k variables, the unknowns of the dependence equation, are the coefficients a1, a2, up through a k. If a is the coefficient matrix of h, then a is an n by k matrix whose columns match the components of the vectors v1, v2, up to vk. So A, we can represent diagrammatically like this, where the vectors appear as the columns of A. We have seen that homogeneous systems are always consistent. Why? The trivial solution we have seen is always a solution. So the system is never inconsistent. Then there are only two possibilities for the number of solutions. H, a homogeneous system, has potentially a unique solution, which of course would be the trivial solution. In this case, the set V1 through Vk is linearly independent. The other possibility for number of solutions for a homogeneous system is H has infinitely many. And if H has infinitely many solutions, it necessarily has non-zero solutions, which means the dependence K equation has a non-zero solution, which means that the set of vectors is linearly dependent.